Hey guys, this is Comic You Know, and today I'm doing a review for Justice League issue 41. Before I start talking about Justice League, just want to give you guys a couple updates. Um, I have a big like father like daughter um, video up and posted, so be sure to check that out. Um, also, of course, I have Comic You Know episode 100, and that's show I review all the comics I read this week in one show. And here are those exclusive comics. We got Giant Size Little Marvels Avengers vs. X-Men issue 1, which I have an in-depth review on Comic Frontline for. Morning Glories, issue 46. The Flash, season 0, issue 9. Batman Beyond, issue 1. Princess Leia, issue 4. Wonder Woman Annual, issue 1. Spider Woman, issue 8. Green Lantern, issue 41. All New X-Men, issue 41. The Amazing Spider-Man, issue 18.1. In Jupiter's Circle, issue 3. So if you want to go check out all those reviews, go to Comic You Know, episode 100, which is annotated. But let's talk about this book, uh, Justice League, issue 41. Uh, so yes, Justice League, we have, uh, I think this is the second part of uh, the Dark Side Wars now. Um, and I was excited to read this. I was pleasantly surprised with part one, and it seems like this is going to be a big game changer for DC, uh, exactly where DC is going. Um, learning a bit more about Darkseid's daughter, and, you know, uh, seeing how the Justice League deals with all of that, and the return of Darkseid uh, since the first arc of the Justice League uh, 41 issues ago. Uh, but very cool cover. I got the Joker uh, cover here. I thought that was pretty cool. And um, artwork is beautiful for this series, really captivates you. Just from the first page here, pouring of wine, perfect. I love, love this artwork here. I mean, I could just show you every page and it's just perfect. So great artwork. Let's see what's going on with the story. So as I said, it's a uh, it's dark side war. It's the start of the dark side war. Um, and we have these two people who are Killing people named, um, I want to get her exact name, um, let me get it, hold on, let me see, um, Miranda Black. Doesn't matter who they are, if her name's Miranda Black, she's dead. And we actually find out who the real Miranda Black is by the end of the issue, and he, she just wants to kill Darkseid. We don't know why, but she wants to, we don't know who she is, and hopefully we'll, we'll learn who she is. Uh, and we get to see the return of, um people wanting to destroy uh, Darkseid, uh, like the Destroyer here. Uh, so just a lot of big, uh, vi um, a lot of big characters being introduced, a, a lot of powerful characters being introduced with this issue. Um, and also we see that people follow Darkseid. Um, from the beginning of the issue, uh, we see the two people who are killing uh, the, the Miranda Black characters uh, are followers of Darkseid. And also Lex Luthor's sister is a follower of the Darkseid. So that was an interesting twist. It shot his, her own brother. Uh, so we'll see where that one goes. And uh, I'm very excited to see uh, where that arc goes. Um, because it's always been that um, Lex Luthor's uh, sister has always been a background character, never really having her own arc, and now finally she has her own arc and going against her brother, which is a really cool twist. Uh, and we do learn a little bit about Darkseid's daughter, um, a little bit more. We actually get to see her fight the Justice League, which is most of the issue. Uh, but yeah, very cool setup issue. Um, also, we learn a bit more about Mr. Miracle, his time on Darkseid's planet, and uh, how he can open up keys a lot. <laughs> That's a big story for, his sto uh, for this issue, for him. You're learning a bit more about, you know, the two children that were switched to different planets, uh, like we learned more in issue 40 with the first part. But very solid start. Um, like I said, the artwork was really well done. I'm intrigued to see where this arc will go. It seems like there's a lot of big players being introduced here. A lot of new players, but big players, like Darkseid's daughter, um, this new Miranda Black person. Uh, and I'm very intrigued to learn more about them. You know, I, I originally did not like the first arc with Darkseid. I didn't really like it. I, you know, I was like, oh, New 52, how do I feel that these characters are so different? Um, but now I feel it's the time to really tell this dark side story and uh, this this whole war and how this will affect DC and how it will affect its universe. Will we see the multiverse? Will this be the arc where we finally see how the multiverse plays a part here? But yes, very good art, solid beginning, and I, I do recommend this issue. And uh, I'm hoping to see, um, you know, uh, more progression with the Dark Side Wars and see where this goes. So Justice League issue 41 
gets four stars. Hope you guys enjoyed. This is Comic Uno. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, in the description below, there's links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. I'll see you guys later. Bye.